Dickinsonia is one of the oldest large creatures on Earth. It became up to 140 centimeters. It is simply a beautiful fossil. It was one of the first discovered ediacarans and they hold the key between a microscopic world of bacteria and the world of large animals. The real nature of these ediacarans is the holy grail of paleontology. For 75 years, people have tried to figure out what these creatures actually were. And there were huge diversity of opinions. There could have been lichen, there could have been giant single-celled creatures, or there could have been animals and our earliest ancestors. And because they tell us something about our own origin, it is very important simply to know finally what they were. So Ilya discovered these organically preserved ediacarans and had the totally crazy idea to look for molecules in them to find out what they finally actually are. The problem with getting those fossils is that they are located quite high in the cliff of the White Sea, in the middle of nowhere, surrounded by bears and clouds of mosquitoes. So to get them we had to go down from the top of the cliff, on the rocks, and then try to dig out huge blocks of sandstone until we actually found organically preserved ediacarabiota fossils. Looking at molecules in these ancient organisms is a game changer. Paleontologists exclusively look at the structure, at the morphology of organisms of fossils. Looking for molecules inside these organisms is entirely new and gives us completely different and complementary information. ANU has one of the most sensitive machines for analyzing biomarkers. We brought samples of the diacrobiota to the ANU. There's a good chance if I've done that anywhere else in the world that just wouldn't work, but here we were able to get the signal. Well, when Ilya showed me the results, I just couldn't believe it. I also immediately saw the significance. It was completely clear. The results are black and white. There's nothing to interpret. These creatures, in fact, produce cholesterol, which is the hallmark of animals, and it tells us this creature, in fact, was our earliest ancestor.